right, so we lost the old if you don't see it already. I hope that fan's not too loud for you there, eh? Let's see if I can cover my jacket if it's quieter. Um, we lost the uh, belt here. It actually looks pretty tore up. flashlight in the truck but if you guys see that there I'm not sure if that's come out just a bit actually if you look at that keyway I'm not sure if you'll be able to see it but it has moved a little bit so it could be touching on that goddamn bracket so Let's see if we can't get that taken care of. sitting in the office thinking oh I haven't really done a video and just as I'm leaving to go home because I got hockey the call comes in with someone stuck in here and of course I'm 40 minutes away I gotta rush to get a little quick fix. The belt is a 440. I got a 420 out of stock room here, but it doesn't have the right uh, the right thing on her. You know what I mean? Now, can I take this? get it on here somehow without having to take this whole damn thing off. Can I or can I not? And do I have as a 420 out of 460? New Year's going good at work. Some are probably happy to be back. Some are probably not happy to be back. I work most of the holidays. Um, which I don't. I mean, it's tough not to be at home all the time, but I always kind of 
prefer to like some people just get the itch when you start you just you're always thinking of it you're always taking the calls for people you know what I mean Which I got the itch and it's never gone away. All I want to do is work on elevators all the time. Loosening up the bracket that holds the uh, big wheel in here. And there's a little like lock nut on here so you can like you can loosen it and know exactly where it goes. Also saying something about the uh, position indicator isn't showing the right floor all the time. But I guarantee you, I won't be looking at that tonight. I could probably just do this, eh? Assisted with uh, diagnosing the what's the older one, the ECI 1000, like the red board. Quickly change that out on the weekend. It was kind of a shot in the dark, but I felt pretty confident ordering it and just changing it um, because I had like what else is there to look at? Like you got uh, we had no elevator running, wouldn't open the door under automatic. Um, wouldn't run in test mode at all and then then you just verify like what is it D, D10 and D7 is like your uh, your feeds Sucks too, eh? Change that in a second. So I had the feet, like you were getting the controller feeds on the the door board. So I mean, what else could it be, right? Oh shit! That'll do. That'll do, donkey. This is not the correct belt. 
but it's gonna get them till tomorrow, you know? You know what I mean? That keyway's moved. Just trying to line it up as best as possible. slop on the a lot of room for adjustment on the uh, bottom of the motor here Stepping on it, maybe. Okay, so we're in the car top. I had to go down and help it closed because when they got the door open, they must have bent the shit out of this light ray. Because it was, I could see if you watch the yellow light there. See, it's good there now, but just below the yellow, the red is like an obstruction. Um, and I could see from above, it was like opening or closing all the way to here and then opening here, opening. And I could see the red light, like false firing. And um, then I looked in between the door and the light ray, instead of being like this, it was bent like this, so. We'll see if she comes up. Here she comes. Probably there's a bunch of floors hit. It's actually a pretty clean building for what we deal with. I had an inspector tell me once that uh, we only take care of cool boat elevators and really shit apartment building elevators. And it just went by. Or, oh, there we go. Cool beans. Hey. Her. I had to look into that light in the PI, but it's working now. Okay, that's it this time. I gotta get the goddamn hockey in 45 minutes. That's a 40-minute drive. See ya.